Right. Hide that. Here we go. We're going to try this out and see if it works. All right. Showing that they updated it. That's nice. What's up? This is Wild High. Uh, just got done doing Raise the, Raise the Underground on Radiocast FM. Thought I'd sit here and play a little bit of uh, Battle for, uh The hell am I playing? Battlefront. <laughs> for Camper Stamper. Which is a uh, Realm of the Mist Entertainment production. It will be uh, hosted by uh, JT Wild uh, when he's able to do so. Right now, I'm doing it just to help him out. Hope you guys enjoy. I'm not that great at this game, so don't expect miracles. I know with a game with a title like Camper Stamper, you expect you know godlike players, but uh, I do all right. I mean, I'm. I'm not really much of a first-person player. I play along with other people for the most part, but you know, I'm more of the RPG and stuff. You'll you'll see me doing more of that type of stuff for this uh, for this type of broadcast. But you know, with Star Wars Celebration just happening and uh, the uh, announcement of Battlefront 2, as well as you know the the trailer for the Last Jedi, <laughs> it made me want to play Star Wars. So here I am. You know, and uh, stupid me, I'm not ready for bed yet, you know, even though it's almost midnight my time. So, we'll play a game. And we're going into a fighter squadron over Soberus. I like me an X-Wing. Tally Imperial fighters, they're vectoring in for our trying And we're already getting our butts kicked. Don't let them get through. Told you I wasn't that good. Ready, standing by. Looking for targets. I don't think that was my kill. Definitely a player. Really? I only got vehicle damage? I didn't get the kill? That's kind of a piss off. Damn it, Falcon, get out of the way. We got a transport ship attempting to escape. Engage. This guy's kind of annoying. thought I had that hey finally 
I, I see a whole bunch of... Ah! I didn't hit my uh, evasive maneuvers fast enough. Here they come. Red 2, standing by. Red 2! I'm Wedge! Again, was I not given credit for that kill? Oh! Darth Vader is out there. Watch out for his tie advanced. Darth Vader, huh? It's away! Yeah, you're a little late on that uh, warning. Our transport ship escaped without taking heavy damage. Good. Oh, you bastard. Stole my kill. God damn it. Enemy ship attempting to flee. Block their escape. God damn it. Red two. Nice of you to join us. There we go. Now we're working it. Now it's feeling like a game. I don't think I'm killing people, I think I'm killing bots. Watch it. You got one on your tail. 
I love how I get two seconds. Two seconds. That's alright, though. Out of all the game types on Battlefront, this is the one I enjoy the most, which is kind of funny because I was never much of a flight simulator guy, you know, in games. I'm staying on you, buddy. Yeah, oh, hello. Of course, right behind me. Imperials inbound. I'm in position. We win. <laughs> Got more kills than I thought I did. Right on. I didn't think I did as well as I did. <laughs> But it's all good, though. I'll take the points. I'll take the bonuses. Oh, yeah. I guess I gotta switch to an actual gun game, because I'm supposed to be doing that disruptor challenge for the Jabba. For the Jabba thing. So, uh, bear with me. We got to do the, the one thing I absolutely cannot stand about this game. And it wasn't, it, memory serves, it wasn't like this when it first came out. But after they loaded so many certain things on this game, it, it really slowed down with its load screens. I don't remember them being this long, but they've really been like this terrible. It's one of the reasons why I don't play it that much. I don't like sitting here waiting forever for you know, the screen to load and then get into another game and it's just it's a long wait. It's like running a 486 computer. <laughs> Some of you guys listening to uh, right now would probably be like, what's a 486? Trust me, you're young. You don't know nothing about it. All right, so we'll go ahead and we'll uh, we'll just do a blast. It got me into a pretty ga uh, game pretty fast. Make a liar out of me. That works out. I think part of it is because they decided to add all these little tips at the bottom, which really weren't necessary. Don't mind me, I know I shouldn't be eating while I'm playing, but, you know, I'm hungry. Like I said, I just got done DJing on Radio Cast FM, so I didn't get a chance to, to eat yet, and this was kind of a last-minute thing to decide to do this, so... Here we go. The ice caves, I'm assuming on Hoth. I didn't look. Using an EE3. And we are owning them so far. Usually takes me a minute to get into the groove of everything going on here. Remembering how the map works and all, so. If I seem like I suck at first, well, first off, I suck. But, uh, 
don't worry, I won't suck as bad once I get back into the groove of the game. Oh, walked right into that. You know, on, on levels like this, I absolutely hate being the Rebels. Because the Stormtroopers just perfectly blend in with the snow. Makes them that much harder to see. Which, I, you know, is the point, but... Still makes it annoying as hell. And they come around behind me. I was throwing random grenades, so I mean, it's not like I was expecting too much out of it. Yay, that was my kill. See, now we're starting to get on it. Remembering how people want to play this game and hug them corners and shit. Whoops. Come on, pull out of that corner. Thank you. What the hell's attacking me? Somebody want to tell me what the hell that was? Did I get it out? Yes, I did! Ha <laughs> ha! Your death is mine! warnings on them thermals. Which is kind of a piss off. I ain't gonna lie. Motherfucker's got all the cool looking, uh, What the hell? Dead. You think I'm alright? I mean, I guess it could be possible, but I highly doubt it. Okay, that was my own fault. I did not check that corner. Can't be too mad at that.
the hell were you shooting me with? Trying to check those corners. Ooh, I think I got last kill too. Ha ha. Ah, seven and eleven. Not great, but hey, at least I'm up there. Another thing I'm not a huge fan of in this uh, in this game is the uh, experience level. It takes forever to level. I guess if you're, you know, players get like 50 kills and only one death or something, it might be better. But the points awarded at the end of each game is really low, in my opinion. We'll do one more before we call this a uh, ah, I know where I am. Boom! I feel all alone. Yeah, somebody come join me. Take those stormtroopers down before they do the same to you. Whoa! Right off the bat, we want to be those types of players. I got you. Come on, heal, heal, heal. Oop, there's somebody coming this way. Coming from behind. The Imperials are rattled. There we go. I want to shoot the droids. We have the advantage now. Stick together. Ah! Sniper mode. Ah! That explains that. Okay. For some reason, I wasn't allowed to join my teammate.
working on it, working on it, working on it. I still got you, so... I forgot I'm supposed to be loading that up. Jesus. Gun doesn't do that shit for me. Oh, nice. Can't much. Are you seriously just camping in one spot? I got an assist out of that. I get for trying to throw a grenade I didn't have. Not sure what happened there. Oh, 
Did I get him at least? What the fuck? The fuck? Not sure where even that came from. He didn't even show up on my radar. Like anywhere near me. That's alright, we won. Who cares? Ah, 12 and 16, not great, but not bad. Third, third highest kills in the game in the game on my team. Deaths aren't that great, but you know. Alright, with that. Like, share, comment, and sub this uh, video. Make sure you check out Breaking the Fourth Wall on uh, RadioCastFM.com and also on this YouTube channel, uh, as well as playing with Kava, uh, another YouTube channel which you can check out anytime you want. Also on Twitch TV, uh, Twitch TV Wild High 77 for me. Uh, I am not as active as other members and if you are interested in becoming a podcast slash gaming member of camper stamper hit me up at uh break the wall podcast at gmail.com and leave me your information if you really want to join in uh we are always looking for gamers uh we want to make the channel consistently 24 hour video games and it will mean that like once a week a sit down podcast discussing video games and uh you know, upcoming things and, and just giving reviews and, and, you know, bitching about games. You know, like all people do. So, uh, thanks for checking this out. I am Wild High. Thank you very much. Have a good night.